Hey everyone, you are on the Proxy Seller Channel. My name is Max. Welcome to today's episode, where I'll be demonstrating how to set up a proxy in Eclipse. Eclipse is a versatile environment that enables you to develop modular cross-platform applications using a wide range of programming languages. Setting up a proxy in Eclipse can help you test your projects with better quality and gain access to localized modules. So, let's get started with connecting proxies. Launch the Eclipse application. Click on Window in the top menu, and then select Preferences. In the Preferences window, go to the General tab and select Network Connections. To add a proxy to the active provider, select Manual. Select the desired protocol and click Edit. As an example, I will show you how to set up the SOX5 protocol. Enter the proxy server and port number, for example, 50101. If you have a private proxy, select the Requires Authentication option and enter the authorization data. If you have a free proxy, you can leave the username and password fields empty. That's it. You have successfully set up the proxy and can now begin testing your applications. I also want to remind you that working with free proxies is not safe, does not guarantee anonymity, and will lead to blocking. To remain anonymous on the network and be sure of your security, it is recommended to purchase a private proxy, and there is an advanced proxy provider, ProxySeller.com. You get 100% anonymity on the network and security, a performance guarantee for the chosen purpose, and 24-7 customer support service. The link will be in the description. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, turn on the notifications by clicking the bell, and hit the like button. That's all for now. See you guys in the next video.